Hello friends, welcome back to Enthralling Sudoku Maniacs. Now, a few days back, on June 11th to be precise, I had published this Crocky Sudoku on my website and it turned out quite tough for quite a few people and I was flooded with requests asking, to, asking me to prepare a walkthrough on this. Now I know we have already done a couple of Crocky's earlier, but still the requests were so high that I had to look into it. So you might be aware of the rules. No digit can repeat in any row, column or 3 by 3 box. A white cell between two, uh, sorry, a white circle between two cells signifies that the two digits will be consecutive to each other. And a black circle signifies that one digit will be twice the other digit in those two cells. Now the digits 1 and 2 can have either a white or a black dot between them, right? So let's dive into the puzzle and see how we can go ahead. Now if you remember from the previous videos, whenever there's a chain of more than one black cell, the central cell can only have a 2 and a 4, so this would be 1, 2, 4, 8, 1, 2, 4, 8. And since Three of the one, two, four digits are logged here. This has to be a three or a six. All right. Similarly, if you remember from our previous lesson, when there are two black cells joined by white dot, the digit three always has to be in the central part. So this could be two, three, four, two, three, four with a 6 here or 6 here. Alright. And again we have this is a black and this is a black. Which basically means the digit 3 has to be one of these two. With a 2, 4 and a 2, 4. Now comes the problem. If this were a 3, this would have to be a 6. But we know in box 7, the 6 is locked in either 8 R8C3 or R9C1. Hence, we know for sure this cannot be a 6 and this cannot be a 3. So, if this is a 2, 4, this has to be a 6, a 3, and this, sorry, becomes a 6, and this will be a 5, 6. So, I can eliminate the 6 and 3 from this black dot. So this becomes my 3 and uh, this would be my 6 with a 5, 7, 8. Alright? So if this is a 2, 4, this would be 1, 2, 4, 8. Now, I can't have a 3 or 6 in this black dot. Now if this were a 2, this would be a 4, 8. Or if this were a 4, it would be 1, 2. I can't have a 1 in the central cell, right? Because that would place a 2 on either sides of that 1. Neither can I have a 1 in this corner cell. The reason being, if this were a 1, this would become a 2 and I would require a 3 here, which is not possible. Correct? So, which basically means the two numbers in R9, C4 and C5 have to be from 2, 4, 8. Now, but the problem is I cannot have a 2 and a 4 because if this were a 2 and a 4, I would not have any digit that can be placed in R9, R7, C4. Hence, 8 has to be a part of this. So basically, this becomes a 4, 8 pair and this becomes a 2. So this has to be 1 and 4. Correct? If this is a 4, this would be 5, 7, 9. I can't have a 1 here because that would place a 2. So the only place for 1 would be here. So I have 1, 2, 3, 4 and this again would be 5, 7, 9. Which of Now. We 
1. So if this is a 6, this is a 6. I would require a 5, 7, 9 would place 4, 6, 8 here. Let's go with that first. So for 4 and 8, it will be 4, 2 and a 3. But I can't have a 2 here because of this 1. So for 4, I can have an 8, 4, 3, 8. Right? Now when I look closely at this row, I have a 5, 7 and a 5, 7. 1 and 6 are lost. So 2, 3, 4, 8, 9. Hmm. So what was the next step? Oh yes, this would be a 2 and a 4. Correct? Now, if this is a 3, yeah, we can jump here, take this out. What was the next one? Very likely. This cannot be a 1 because of this 2 here. It can't be a 2. It can't be a 4 as well. I can have an 8, 3 or a 6. If this is a 3, 6, this also would be a 3, 6. And if it were an 8, oh, sorry, I can't have a 3 here as well because that would also be consecutive to 2. So I have a 6 and an 8, which would make this a 3 and a 4. Now the trick here is, if this were a 3, this consecutive position would require a 2 and a 4. But I cannot have a pair of 2 and 4 adjacent to each other without a black dot. Hence this has to be a 4, this becomes, sorry, a 2. This would be a 5, because the 3 is already available, and this would become an 8. Right? And this would be again a 2 and an 8. So 6, 6. 6 can only be here or here. Now, this 3 cannot be here, it cannot be here. So 3 is locked in this, which means for this 3, 3 will have to be here or here. But I can't have a 3 in R3, C4 because that would may require a 2 or a 4 in R4, C4. But we already have the 2 and 4 placed in column 4. So this cannot be a 3. This is a 3. The consecutive would be a 4 because the 2 is already available. So this would be a 2 and an 8. Right? So if this is a 4, this is an 8, this is a 4. This will be a 7 and a 9. The missing digits are 1, 7 and a 9. So 1, 7, 9, 1, 7, 9, 1, 7, 9. Now, this is 5, 7, 9. I can't have a 1 as part of this white dot because the 2 is already occupied. So this is a 1. So this becomes a pair of 7 and a 9 and I have a 1 here. So 7, 9. We took 9 with a white dot or will always require a 8. And if the 8 is going being paired with the 9, then 7 would require a 6 to be paired with it. But I can't have a 7 here because the 6 is already there in the room. So this would be a 9, this would be an 8, 7, 6. 2, 5, and the consecutive to 5 would be a 6, because I already have a 4. So this becomes a 6, and this would become a 5 and a 7. Now with the 6 here, I can't have a 3, because there is no black dot available. So this would be, and I have a 7 and a 9 remaining. But again, I can't have a 7 beside a 6, because there is no white dot there. So this is a 9, this is a 7, this becomes a 5. 7, 9, and this becomes a 5. And because of this 5, I can't have a 4 
So this will be a 2, which makes this a 1, 4 again. So this 8, 9 cannot be here. 8, 9 goes and gets here. This becomes a 7. So we have made some progress and now when I look at the row 9, the missing digits are 1, 2 and 5. Now I do not see any white dot and since 1 and 2 are consecutive to each other and also have a 1 is to 2 ratio, they cannot be beside each other. So that would make this a 5 and I can't have a 2 beside a 4 because there is no black dot. So this is a 1 and a 2. Right? And with this one here, this is a 4, this is a 1. I got a 7, so this has to be a 5, 2, 8, and 9. So I can't have a 2 beside a 3. So this has to be a 2, which makes this 8 and a 9. Hence, this has to be a 1, 2, 4 series. So this is a 2, 1, because this is a 1, so this has to be a 4. And that's a 5 and a 7. 7 and a 5. Right? And the missing digits for row 2 are 2, 5 and 7. So 5 and 7 can never be beside a black dot. So I know for sure this has to be a 2 with a 4 because the 1 is already on. Right? So this is a 7 and a 5 because we have a 5 at R9, C8. And for 4, the next consecutive number would be a 3. And this again would be an 8 and a 9. Again, I can't have a 9 with a black dot. So 8, 9, and this becomes an 8. So this is a 4. This would become a 2 because this has to be at least double or half of 4 and also consecutive to 3. So I can't have a 1 here. I, this will become a 1. This is a 6 and this is a 9. So once this 4 is out, I know for sure this has to be a 6 and a 3. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7 and 8. So this pair has to be 7 and 8. This becomes a 5. I can't have an 8 here because there is no white dot beside the 9. So this is a 7 and an 8. So that leaves me with 3 and 8. So 2 is consecutive with 3, 8, 8, 9. So the consecutive digit with 8 is a 7. That leaves me with 1 and 9 here. I'll leave that and this becomes a 4. So the missing numbers here are 4, 7 and the double of that would be 8 and 9. So I have 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 1 and 3 are missing. This becomes a 1 and 3. You guys it right. There's no white dot beside the 4. So this is a 1, this is a 9. This is a 9 and this is a 6. And that was how this was supposed to be solved. I know the start was the trickiest part, but the moment you get the 3 and 6 pairing in box 7 and 8, the puzzle just opens up. I always say, the puzzle is only difficult if you don't find the breakthrough. The moment you get a breakthrough, the puzzle always becomes easy. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, do like and share it with your friends. Now compared to the earlier crop kit that we had posted, which one do you think was a better example? Do let us know in the comments. And if at all you wish to see a video on a specific variant, I would love to hear that in the comments section. So make sure you do comment and let me know which variant you would like to see. And once again, if you have not subscribed to the channel, I suggest you do that right away and click on the bell icon so that you are notified of new content as and when we publish them. So, till the next time, happy solving!